This is my toolbox with all the really essential stuff. I keep two sets of drill bits in there, one set of twist drills in this box and one set of hex shank bread point bits in this bag. I think the problem with the plastic bag doesn't really take much of an explanation. It just takes too long to fumble the right drill bit out of there. And of course they are also damaging each other. But this box here is also pretty annoying because if you need one of the smaller drills you kind of have to make sure that the others won't also come out and drop on the floor. So I really need to slash want to come up with a better solution than that. And this is what I came up with. A cylindrical container with a swiveling lid. Of course I embossed my name in its side, which makes me a really cool designer. The lid is textured so that it can be operated even with the sweatiest thumb. A ball detent keeps the lid from rotating unintentionally. I printed the parts out of PLA, which is way strong enough. They printed at 50 mm per second, 40% infill and 200 degrees centigrade at the nozzle. I removed the burr with a file and the secondary burr with some steel wool. I cut an M3 thread, but you could also use a self-tapping screw. For the ball detent I use an airsoft BB and a spring from a stolen biro. And some crazy glue as thread locker. These things could be made a little bit more compact by using a smaller BB, like a 5mm ball from a ball bearing or something, but I just wanted to use a 6mm airsoft BB. Here you can see how the BB in this hole will snap into that hole in the lid and keep it from rotating. To make them look fancy I painted those and I sprayed on some varnish to protect them against dirt. They can be operated one-handed and they can't roll away. And the 5S stands for 5mm short. And it also stands for 5S, I know. Keep in mind that I have to do this with a camera rig in front of my face, so in reality it goes even smoother. And finally the center punch. Okay, here I have to add that the goal of these is not to cram as many drill bits as possible in as little space as possible. The goal is to visualize the drill bits, to make them easily accessible and to keep everything in order. <laughs> 